I don't know if they can see, but there's the queen. See her running around inside there. Yeah. I'll pull out some of that comb. They'll swarm to it, huh? We hope. Yeah, they really hadn't figured out she's up there yet. Normally, if you're messing with a hive where they've already got comb and something, they've actually got something to defend. Uh -huh. Usually yeah. with, uh, say, a swarm, they don't have anything. So they don't, they don't bother you. Uh -huh. and, I mean, you grab handfuls of them, as long as you don't crush one, they don't bother, they don't try and sting you or anything like that. <clears throat> but whenever you got something like this, they got something to defend. So they may or may not be aggravating. Yeah. Which these aren't. These seem to be real nice. But even though they do have some, but they haven't been here long, so maybe that's why they're not quite yeah. so uh, so aggravated with me messing with them. If he don't crush them, he's all right. Yeah. If I if I start making them mad at me, then I probably put something on. and set that in there real nice so I don't crush any of them. Now the honey would be in those cones? Yes, sir. They have, they, to, uh, have to extract it. Oh, I see. You can see some out. coming out yeah. there. And that can be that can be honey or it can be nectar. Uh -huh. Which uh, with nectar, which is most likely what this is because they hadn't been here long. Yeah. But with nectar, what they've got is uh, they collect the uh, nectar from the flowers. Yeah. And they pack it in there. And what changes it to honey, more or less, is... Uh, the uh, water content. I see. And it's got to get down to a certain amount. So they'll get on that comb and they'll wave their wings and they'll do whatever they can to get it to dry out. When it gets to a certain consistency, and I don't know how they figure it out, but uh, when it gets, you know, just at the right moisture content, they'll cap it off. Huh. And a lot of times you can tell by looking at the color of the caps on it, the size, the shape and all that, yeah. as to whether it's actually brewed, the, the young, or if it's uh, honey or something like that. Yeah. Yeah, Brett and I flipped that over. My son and I, we moved it Sunday. <laughs> and I said, no, I don't want to mess with it. <laughs> so Brett came out and looked and he said, oh, those are honeybees. I was afraid they might be yellow jackets. Yeah, that's a lot of, uh, a lot of times people will mistake the honeybees with yellow jackets. Yeah. It's pretty easy to do.
glad they didn't get in the eave of the house. Yeah. But I'd have to just kill them then. Yeah, because, I mean, that's where you get to the point that you got to start ripping things loose. Yeah. And uh, cutting stuff out. I'll put it to you this way. I can definitely cut them out, but I ain't a carpenter. <laughs> <laughs> I've done a little carpenter work, but I don't want to do it on the house anymore. Oh, yeah. I'm sure glad we didn't have to kill them. Yeah. I mean, they're, they're, they're really good uh -huh. for uh, the environment. Uh, there's a lot of farmers that will take and uh, they'll actually lease. They'll pay somebody to come in and put a hive uh -huh. close to their, their crops. Yeah. Because uh, it can increase the yield. I'm not sure exactly how much, but I do know that it can increase the yield quite a lot. Huh. And I mean, if you can look at, you know, 30% extra, yeah. you know, worth of whatever your crop is, well, what about those that? About, how about how much you get? Yeah. And that's a pretty good bit. You gotta take that other two? Yeah. Once in a while, you see a documentary on TV on this stuff. Uh huh. It fascinates me. Is there any out in No. They were all down there. He's got, he's got the queen bee in there. So these will all dissipate. Clean that a little bit with some Clorox, get that out, and that should get rid of the smell so they wouldn't come back to it. <coughs> Now they're busy. Yeah.
what they'll do is they'll, uh, the ones that says, okay, the queen's in here, they'll get on the front and they'll fan their wings and her smell will come out and the rest of them will get to it and they'll go running up in there. Okay, there she is. We need to get back to the colony. You see how they're, they're marching in on the far oh, side yeah. over there? Oh, yeah. Look at that. 